Hi, Grand Rising uh, to all. Let me see here. I'm just, uh, it's going to be like a, a quick Q&A, not very length, lengthy. Let me check my mic there. Uh, I'm not even going to start video because I'm just going to get right into sharing screen here. I'm going to optimize for video clips. Yep, and then share. Uh, okay. Looks good. Okay. Um, I get questions every once in a while uh, from participants and members of the uh, meetings. We're working together to you know, complete this first treasury pack to the United States Treasury in Puerto Rico. So um, you know, just not to, sh uh, to keep his identity anonymous, uh, one of our participants is asking these questions and rather than just you know, spend 20 minutes or a half hour answering these, I'm just gonna answer them publicly through this video. So I have a few questions regarding the documents in the folder that we need to complete. Okay, it's a pack of about you know thirty documents, say, uh, but we're finding out now that not all of them need to be sent in right away. In regards to the templates, they are on standard size eight and a half by eleven paper. Uh, he's mentioning this is because I decided on my own to go to eight and a half by 14. Are any of them required to be on legal sized paper, eight and a half uh, by 14 paper? So to stop right here, I'm just gonna actually separate these questions. Okay, so now regarding this, I know most of the groups that I've used, uh, I've uh, participated in, I, only the power of attorney is generally on legal paper here, uh, but all the others were, you know, short eight and a half by 11. So that would answer that question. This really, it would be all up to you. Um, I've mentioned, I mean, I'll bring it up, is if you watch this uh, video, it's on a Radiant Clone YouTube channel. I'll, I'll even, I, own, I have it locally. Um, give me one moment. I should have paused. So if you watch this video here, which is titled here, if you could see it or not, it is uh, 26. Okay, uh, just scratch the 26. But if you go to the Radiant Clone YouTube channel, the Secured Party Creditor Instructions by Karen, if you see here, and this VLC player, look, look at this, look at this. You guys got to get this thing. This is really nice. You could scan and then you, you record. I, I already have a video on my YouTube channel how to record uh, YouTube videos, any YouTube video online with the VLC player. So any video I like, because they're, they're deleting a lot of uh, YouTube videos now, YouTube channels. That's why you should always bookmark them. And then and then if you have time or have you know family members or staff, you could uh, have them just record the entire YouTube channel. So this way you can have it when you go to remote areas on vacation and stuff, and then you have a local copy. So now if you notice right here, I wish I could see what this is. Let me use the Zoom, the Zoom feature, um, effects, video, advanced, geometry, interactive Zoom. Let me see if I could see what that is. What is that there? That looks like the something indemnity agreement. Common, no, it's not the common law. But anyway, if you notice here, you know, that's not eight and a half by 11. So, you know, and it's not the power of attorney. So she already did what I thought to do before I even watched this video. This is her pack. It's binded. If you see down here, you see down here. It's bound, it's, bound, it's bound, you know, I'm gonna do it at a printer, but you could do it at a FedEx. I'm just, since I already have a printer, I know a printer, I've been using them for, you know, like 10 years. And then before that I had a printer, he's also gonna make my ticket book, which I've been mentioning in my videos where you can write uh, law enforcement officers tickets and stuff. So, so that's that. Now, what you can also do, going back to the questions here, is you can also keep it on eight and a half by 11 document but pick the, 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 the tray cartridge legal if you choose. 
you, you could do both. If you have time, lay one out in small, lay one out in large. And then what you do is you put your hands on, you close your eyes and you do whatever ceremony you got. And you, and you see which one magnetizes you more. Like, and then just search your heart. Your heart's going to tell you the answer. I've been doing this all my life. It's never failed me. What you do is you, you feel the energy on it, you know? Uh, and then you, you, whichever one draws your left hand, it has a magnetism to your left hand more. That's the one you pick because the left hand is receiving. So you're not giving energy. You're not going to use your right hand. You're going to use your left hand, which is the receiving hand. And then um, you, you, you just put your hand over it and then you see which one gives you a better energetic signature. And then you, you ultimately, this is your world, your commander and chief of your vessel. So you're going to have to decide. I'm deciding on what going on everything now. He asked about, especially about set off bond, because it fits, per okay, look. If so, which ones, for example, the, the set off bond and indemnity bond templates. Let me see if I can just bring those up. I'm gonna pause the video a second, stop sharing. So this way I can, you know, I, it won't be in the recording. I'll be right. Or you could do this here. It's it's winter now, it got, it got below 50. So look, I got the hoodie on over here. Woo. Okay, so, I mean, this is what I did. Now, I didn't like this border because it looks so dull. I spent one day, one day finding this right here. The other one, the I never saw this indemnity bond. I, 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 I didn't see this while I was working on the other document. So if I would have found this because I like this the way it is, uh, it, you know, it's really crisp because the other one was so dull. But before I saw this, because you this is green for indemnity bond, because the indemnity bond is for like you're going to use for like, you know, health insurance or your insurance or so insurance is kind of like green. You know, that's why this is green. But for the um, the bond for set off for the, you know, the bond that's for set off, it's in blue. I was not crazy about the perimeter because it's been like scanned and, and everything. So I spent one day finding and doing this this border right here. I have not even done this, but I could shrink this down, you know, to make it, uh, and then you could basically, exactly what I'm saying is, you could take the bond and put it on legal, so this way you can put your stamp over here. You know, it's it's actually the opposite side, but, but you know, you put the stamp, you, you, you know, you put your thumbprint, you sign it, and uh, so you could do that, that's all. Let me stop share, and then, you know, this I'm going to shrink, but I got up to that point and then I had other stuff to do because I have a, I have a life like, you know, I have to, I have to survive like today. Right. As soon as I'm done with this, I'm, I'm going to make some phone because I have to go to work because I need money uh, to, 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 to get all of this stuff done. Get that silver charity bond. I need a couple of you know, a couple of bucks to get those little silver bullion. Uh, let me shut this video off. Pause for a second. I'll be right back. All right. So now to show you on the screen here. See uh, this, you could you could tweak around with this uh, and I'm sharing, right? Uh, I just make sure I'm sharing the screen. Good, share. Okay, so here um, you could also kind of try, I tried because otherwise it was gonna look really dull, but I made this really blue but it's so, it's a copy of a copy of a copy. I didn't like it. That's why I did that other one, you know, and that's only for, like, yeah, I mean, I mean I'll, I'll share that, but only with, only with members, you know, like, uh, I, mean, I have to, have, anyway. So uh, this is it right here. I guess on this document, I didn't make it long, but uh, you know, if you, here, you, all you do is you just change the, the layout here, page size. You go not letter, you go legal, and then you just move everything up. You know, you you have to work on it basically. But I've, I, you know, and I think you could do this. Oh, unless it's a background, you got to figure it out. So I'll undo, and I won't save this. And then I have another document here, which is the. Let me see what's this. Oh, this is the one I made. I, I this kind of, this came out nice, boy. I, I, I just like it. Uh, I don't even know if I'm going to use it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take the green one. Where's the green one? I didn't open the green one. Let me pause this for a second. All 
Okay, so this is the indemnity bond here. What I'm going to do ultimately is, you know, I, I mean, I even though I spent the day getting that template from Shutter Shock and stuff, and then I found this, I was so pissed because this is nice and crisp. I think I'm going to use this one and just take the template and make it blue for the other one. It's a lot of work, but I'm going to do it that way. I want mine to look perfect and crisp. I do not like that other dull one from the original document. So that answers that. And you know, you have if you have access to the master cl uh, class uh, drive, that's where you have this stuff. Uh, I didn't even fill it out or anything because uh, uh, you know I got sidetracked doing other stuff. Next, if so, which ones, for example, also we just went over that on the highlighted island items on the template. Do we change the font color to black to match with the rest of the document? I'll show you. This is what you do. Watch this. If if this is what you're referring to, see this is this is nothing is highlighted here. Let me find another document that's highlighted. This either. I guess I'll do. I don't know how this guy's name is in here. This one either. None of them. I guess, yeah, these are not, I, I know there was ones that were highlighted, but I can't seem to find them I, unless I changed it. But anyway, this is what you do. If they're all highlighted, right? If they're, if this is highlighted, right? Say, come on, uh, where's the highlighter right here? You highlight it in blue, okay, whatever. I hate that color. That's gotta be yellow. Are you kidding me? I want a lighter color. What the, anyway, see? So if you got that here and then you do another highlight here, right? Okay, that's what I wanted. So now if you got this and then you go to the bottom of the document, right? Very carefully, you go like this. Once you're done and you're done and you're done and you're done and it's finished, you go like this all the way. And then you just do right here. You go like this, no color. And it doesn't change anything. It just takes out all the highlighting. Let me, let me, let me read through that again and make sure that that's what on the highlighted items of the templates, do we change the font color to black to match with the rest of the document? You just remove the highlighting, it's already in black. And then also what you could do is, you know, if, if, you're, if you think that it might not be, you just go like this, right? And then through the whole document or whatever, and then you do um, font, let me see. Right here, font color, black right there. It is always white and black here. See if I do white and it is black. So you do black if you wanted to do that, if that answers your question. Okay, On the, all right, black to match the rest of the document. When autographing, this is a long one. Okay, I'm gonna do it right here. But I'm, I'm going to make a video on this because this is really interesting. And we're, we're using telepathy and with, this is like a collective conscious effort, right, of what's going on. But this is actually important. All right. I'm going to use me. So, you know, we got the all caps, right? Uh, caps. Uh, you know, and then you can have the copyright symbol here, you know, and then the trademark up here. So now the first dot, this is what I'm doing. I've already decided. The first one I'm doing, because uh, to have layers of protection, you're going to do numerous ones. So, you know, obviously, this is if you ever have to sign this, this you're going to use in black. Let me get some more room here. Uh, like this. So it could be like, because oh, I want to do it almost like a flow chart. Oops. So the first. The first set of documents 
is, I'm going to center this second. Okay. First, is is this is this is in black you know when you have to fill this in ever but black and then your second one is going to be um upper upper lower and i already have my documents in purple i'm changing them i'm changing them to blue right now and and this also this is up to you whatever you think all right so this is your first set of documents you, you you're gonna i'm gonna do this is what i chose to do and then you're not not all of the documents that are listed here this is just the generic you know this is just the un, unworked on files just give it a little second for this to populate you know, not all of the documents, but after you do that first pack and you finish that whole first pack, not all of them, but I would have to, you know, that would be a lot of uh, thought to find out which ones, but this is what I'm going to do. I'm almost 100% sure, maybe 98, 95 to 98% sure that this is what I'm going to do on my first set of documents. Then to have layers of protection, um, this guy then, right? The upper lower, I would consider this one to be this it would be the you know straw man. This would be the this would be the debtor, this would be the creditor. Okay. I'm not even gonna change the color to blue, and this is the debtor. Okay. Okay. Now, then afterward, if you want to follow through with this right here, with the first pack treasure pack, you'll, you'll never be able to spend all that money in your, but what you want to do is you want to have layers of protection. I really should put this second one on top, which I might do afterwards, but just for, for this case right here, then uh, what you're going to do is, is then you're going to have the creditor or the creditor, and then you're gonna have private. Oops. Because there's a delay in it and it messes me up. Because it, it can't, it, 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 because of the Zoom, it can't react fast enough to what I'm, what I'm doing. So then this one's gonna be from the creditor to private. If you've ever noticed, um, no, I didn't want it to be capped. Then this one's gonna be red or purple, you know, all purple. So this is gonna be your second identity right here. This is actually an important video. This should be up on top of this, really. If you think about this person is the one that's gonna get buried, you know, so the second, this has to go in reverse. I'm gonna do it right now, just so, just so you know. It's gonna be like a pyramid cut. I'm going to another page, a fresh page. I'm even going to say right here, look, hell. And then you got this right here.
Okay, now. I, I've been wanting to do this on a flow chart, nice and proper. So this is your, you know, this, this guy right here is in hell. We know, we know about that. You know, we've all been through this, you know, with the vaccines as a kid, you know, 11 years old, I didn't need a fill in. They gave me a fill in, changed my life, got sick, gained like 30, 40 pounds, kept getting ear infections. That damn, that damn dentist. Uh, it's just because I chipped my tooth. And once they get a hold of you, then they do whatever they, they're like, oh, 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 you need a fill in over here. It's like, it's, and then that thing, oh my God, that killed me. Anyway, so we got help. Then we go over here. This is the uh, from from the creditor to private. It should be you know, it's gonna, you know from the upper lower in blue to the private and red. I mean, this is just my mind, but I, I I believe I think I'm right. So now, just for argument's sake, I'm just gonna take this like this. Oops, I didn't want to do that. Copy. Keep source formatting. Okay, now the third. Okay, is gonna be private. to the trust. Just when you get your 98 number, they put it in parentheses like this. Oh, come on. Oops. And this is exactly how it comes up on my 98 thing. Now, this is going to be international. So you could do the red down here, you know, from the creditor to the private, or you can do purple. You know, it depends on how you're going to go. But if you're going to if you're going to go all the way, you're going to do this. Right. And then the trust right here, then you're going to do this one in purple. If you if you do this, because from black to uh, from uh, black to blue, then from blue to red. Let me make sure I'm right here. Uh, debtor, creditor, blue, creditor, private, red, private, red, to international, just only to trust blue. Look. Purple or gold. If you're not going to go any further, use gold on this. But I'm going further. And I'm going to show you exactly right now. I'm going to do all, most, a lot of my documents, not all of them. You know, you're not going to make, but, but you can. You can. You can make bonds and you can do everything. You know, I, I, I don't, I don't actually know if you could do every single thing, but let's get yourself protected first, right? So now, also, all of these right here, for example, when you get to the trust portion here, this is, is you know, the beneficiaries of, you want to have one thing, but not this one. You're going to make another one because now you're going to have heirs, you're going to have family, they're going to be the beneficiaries to all the, all the you know, the, the debt and riches and, you know, that you're going to have, you're going to leave, uh, you know, in your will when you graduate, you know, when you transition. So now here, since this is really co-mingling with all of this, you want to have that with a different name. If you, if you, if you chose, if you want to keep this, you're going to have to do another one on top of this for your, for your family. And then that one you can keep because on the 98s, you're going to be specifying or not, you're going to be specifying who created this trust. Is there a identifying number? Let me do something here. 
is there an identifying number? For example, here to here, you wouldn't have an, a 98. This was technically would be your estate number here. When, but when you're going into getting these trust right here, it's this. Who's creating this right here? So you could either you could either say, okay, well, the the identifying person, which is uh, you know, the social, created this trust, then it ties it into this. Uh, there may be a reason which I do not have the answer now. PJ did that. I, I think they guided him to do that. He linked this trust, which I think I am going to do with his social. So it's kind of like pass through to the estate and then pass through to this trust. So, you know, over here, this is where it gets a little gray, but I think together and plus with this group, and I have some very knowledgeable people that I'm in communication with, and I, I, I need, I would love to have their, uh, you know, their feedback on this. I'm not gonna reach out directly because they're starting to watch the videos even earlier or later. And, uh, you know, please comment on them because that would be a good way to publicly, even if you could use a, a pseudonym, like you don't have to use your, your, your real name or anything, just, you know, comment on the video. I see all comments and then I could make a video and course correct and then uh, report it and inform the entire group. So this way, you know, we save time because otherwise we're going to do something wrong. But this is pretty concrete. Now, your fourth one, you could go all the way to your highest because now, you know, balanced with this here, it like uh, on the same level as this with the trusts, you know, any foundations, companies, organizations, tribes, may, you know, you're going to, you're going to have to do, if, if not a trust, it's going to be something else, but international, you got to decide if you're going to, if you're going to show who created it, or is it an independent, fresh, new thing? So this, you have to decide on, I didn't, I, I put no tin. So this has no connection to these. So I may leave this and either create another one. You can create as many as you want. You can create another Jeff and Lita Trust. And then that one you tie in, whereas this one you keep private. You know, you keep private or you can call the one you're going to keep private, which the actually let's do this. Th this is the one that you're going to tie in. Right. This is the one that you're going to tie into your whole system because they do need a trust for you to, uh, to you know, for you to open up bank accounts and stuff and deposit everything in. It's going to be either a trust or a business. So, for example, the fourth one would be a business, you know, which could be, let's say, you know. Let me do this. Okay, fourth is gonna be international. And then underneath that would be international. This, to, to go to the gold, you gotta just I mean, I want to think it through right now. Let me pause. No, I already know. I, I've been thinking about it all day this week. So that's why we're, we're using telepathy here. It wouldn't even be under this. It would be a complete independent thing. Let me just do something here. All right, let me see. All right, we got this here. Let me just, all right. Hell is black to blue. Predator is blue to red. Private. Then private to international is purple. This you kind of have tied in with this. Anyway, let me start doing it. And then anyway, I'm going to just start uh, and then I'll figure it out as I, I I'm just going to do because I'm going to do this is your ghost protocol right here. It's your highest, highest one. You know, the ghost protocol is going to be like your seventh heaven. That's why they call it seventh heaven, because you got to have like seven by. I'm going to show you right now. This one right here, ghost protocol, 
You could be whatever you want. You could be, I'm gonna tell you right now. I wanna pause the video. Okay, so the, to get to heaven, right? Let me share a screen. That seventh, wow, I got this many documents open. I gotta close these. I don't need any of them. Wow, all right, I'll leave them. So to get to seventh heaven, you, to get to ghost protocol, no, it's not, it's not even ghost protocol. Now it's seventh heaven. Uh, seventh heaven would be, you're gone. You're like, you're, 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 yeah, yeah, it's ghost protocol. Yeah, seventh heaven is your ghost. Basically you, you turn into, you turn into air, you know, and then you get from hell up to, 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 you know, like the highest peak. So now right here, you could basically go back to God. Seventh heaven, you gotta, you could do a symbol. Why do you think, you know, Prince never died. I, they, he has so much money that he faked his death because he figured out the secure party creditor thing. You know, he, he basically found out how to do it because, you know, when you're in Hollywood and you're an actor like that, you meet angels. You meet because intermingling with all of these satanic, you know, Satanist pedophiles, you know, pedophiles, intermingling with them at these parties are, are people that work for the light. Same thing with the military, same thing with the Vatican. It's a yin and yang balance. It, you can't have all evil, you know, all the time. You can for the age of Pisces. You know, for the age of Pisces, it was, it was, it was, you know, evil, evil ruled. You know, it started, you know, with, with the Rome, you know, with the Roman Empire and stuff. And uh, but now that's over. And they wages, there's nobody taking the reins. So it's up to us. You know, we are the hero that we've been waiting for. Um, they want to, it's, this is what the new world order is, the new world order. They're trying to take over control of the world, but they, they can't because it's a different age and you have to follow the, uh, what's radiating out of the sun. So the sun right now is justice, you know, is, is justice. In other words, is freedom, but how they're controlling the people is with the chemtrails, with the calcification of the body and especially the pineal gland with the harp, they can download, they can make you, they can control your dreams with that. If you're calcified, just like Wi-Fi, just like downloading an app, just like downloading a, a something, I mean, think about it, aluminum. We used to have these old antennas in the seventies and eighties to watch TV and you have to move the antenna. What is that made of? Remember, you could bend them. You could bend them. We used to use play play like uh, sword fighting with them. And um, those are the, uh, you know, they're all aluminum. So now if you have all this aluminum using aluminum foil, I, I don't have aluminum foil. I needed it for something. Oh, I actually, I do have aluminum trays because sometimes I do not have Wi-Fi in my house. My Wi-Fi is turned off. I don't have Bluetooth. I don't use Wi-Fi at all, at all. If I need it for some reason, I turn it on five minutes, I get a headache, everything, and then I turn it right back down. But sometimes I think that the uh, my router is is trying to ping, you know, like trying to do something, but I have it disabled. Uh, I take two aluminum trays and I put them one over the other over it, but it overheats a little bit if I'm ever working near the router. Anyway, that's it. So now this is one. Me, my name, Jetan, means infinity. So, you know, me, my ghost, my ghost protocol would be either this or the yin and yang symbol, you know? And, you know, you called me like, well, what if I have a special character? Then they, 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 they guide you. You have to, you make a document basically with this symbol over your, your, your name in parentheses, you know, formally known as exactly the way Prince did it the actor formerly known as. So that's your ghost, that's your ghost protocol right there. Your seventh heaven. So now, um, going back to this. Okay, seventh heaven, ghost protocol, it's a symbol. Well, here, let me do it. <clears throat> Let me pick a beautiful one. Oh, look at this, how cute the cats. 
Let me just go simple. You gotta open it up into a new tab and then you save the image. Save image as. Come on. <clears throat> Right here, 55, uh, 55, uh, yin and yang. Insert image. Slow. I, I look at that turn. Look at it turn. That's so crazy. Look. All right, this makes it complicated when, well, I guess not. All right, ghost protocol, and then this right here is gold. You know, it's gold or you can make anything, you, blood. Blood, you could use blood. You get like a one of di like a diabetes um, uh, thing, or you have a special dagger, you know, with a very sharp point. You keep rags, I'm gonna do a lot of stuff in blood. So ghost protocol, symbol, formerly known as, and blood some blood rituals go go ask the uh the voodooans how to do it go, go got a lot of work to do in um in haiti go over there and meet with all those those voodooan shamans see if we get some knowledge from them that's why they want to that's why they want to destroy that 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 country it's not happening definitely not happening not on my watch uh formerly known as former lee known as okay seven so now over here this is important right here this is important so this is this is this guy here you don't even want to do this you know but but you could you could but it's not going to be tied into any anything else all it's going to be when you do the 98 it's not you're not going to say you know this this uh 98 created this trust right you're not going to do that this one's going to be completely independent but what you do is you make it a beneficiary you make seventh heaven this symbol the beneficiary of everything it's just very very detailed but this is how you do it. i have it all mapped out in my mind seven let's go to let's go see what um four is okay this is what it is for me. You know, this is what it is for me. I'm not going to spill all the beans of what I'm doing because I, people watch me and then they took a domain that I wanted that was available next day. So I'm not going to do, I'm not going to say everything. This stuff I already have copyrighted, so they can't do. This right here, they, you can have as many of these, you know, anybody can have this. I'll make one with a little line, whatever. They, you know, they can't do anything. But as far as names, they could copyright and trademark them. So I'm not, I'm going to do this right here for me. My sixth heaven right here is going to be. Center here. My sixth heaven is going to be. Which because I have to work on this, but just to just to shoot it out, I'm going to just say. I'm going to make a group that's going to have a similar name to this. Okay, that's it. So on this right here, this is good, right? On this United Nations, it's not the United Nations is going to have a different name. This United Nations is going to have numerous, numerous, numerous um, nations that are going to be in a coalition to this entity right here and what they're going to do is they are going to that's why i wanted to do a flow chart but just let me try and see if i can explain how this breaks down here 
you have to work for a collective at one point. And all the, the beneficiary for a collective, like a tribe, has to be every single participant evenly, right? Because otherwise people get greedy. Trust me, I know, I've went through it. Everybody gets greedy, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm non-corruptible. I am absolutely, completely, 100% non-corruptible. Nobody can corrupt me because I'm non-corruptible. I can't. So now, United Nations. So you're going to have, let's say you have, let's say each one of these is, is, a, is, a, is a tribe. Let's say, I want to just do like two or three of them. So you got one tribe here, right? Okay, I didn't want that. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh huh. This is actually interesting because <laughs> there's seven there. Because this is exactly what I'm doing. And it's, uh, this is 14, so I got to take one out. Center, all right. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. This is exactly what I'm doing. There's 13 tribes that I'm working with right now. So these tribes right here, if they have 1,000 members, right? If they have 1,000 members each, right? Should I, I'm not even going to do it. If these tribes have 1,000 members each, right, and they are going to make a, a peace treaty with the higher thing here, these also can have other, they can support and have other uh, kind of like uh, trusts that are, were created by this. And then they can have their own beneficiaries. These 1,000 people in that tribe, it's going to have 12 trustees. You know, just like like in the Bible, right? All mixed men, women. You're gonna have every zodiac sign. It, you know, it should be every zodiac sign. With all, you know, elders. These are gonna be the twelve elder trustees of of a tribe of a thousand. Who is the benefit? Yeah, they're gonna get their salary. They're all. It's all a voting system, right? So that voting system, everybody has to vote. They're going to have an app. You got to say, this is important. You got to say yes or no on this. You know, should we have a death penalty? You know, should we, uh, you know, hang people or, um, you know, we could pardon them. We could have the, you know, death penalty, but uh, for, for treason, let's just say, if somebody, you know, somebody comes in and does treason on you, I'm going to have a death penalty. But, the, you know, ultimately the people will vote and then you wind up exiling them. This is all lawful, international, natural, common law. So now, but the beneficiaries to all of these people, imagine these thousand people, you know, you're going to train them, it might take them 10 years, you're going to birth them, it might take them 20 years when they get mature. Now, these people are going to become creditors. They're going to create their own nation, right? So, so these thousand people here are the beneficiaries. They must be. You cannot have a beneficiary. You know, they have to be the beneficiaries, but they can make a peace treaty with other tribes. And, and then they could make an alliance, uh, you know, an alliance. What, it's not a peace treaty. I, I wrote it down. I wrote it down. Look at this. A non-war harmonious habitation bond. No peace treaties. We're whole. We're not peaceful. Mm -mm, not at all. Not in any, any form or fashion. We have a harmonious habitation bond. And then you could do it in blood too. Uh, they, they still do blood bonds in my country. We are one of the most ancient civilizations in Europe. We still have blood brothers. You know, I don't know if you have them here or not, but we do. With my grandmother talks about them all the time. I have not done one yet, but, but you know, with, you know, with somebody, but I'll just, I definitely will now, now that I found tribes. And, you know, family is frequency. That's Baba G, nature boy. I honor and respect him. He's a very great teacher and uh, I, I love him and his whole tribe. And I'm going to make a harmonious habitation bond with him, you know, a non-war harmonious habitation bond. And what he 
you know, made brought into my awareness is that is that your 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 regular biological family is not your real family. Yes, you could take care of them, let them go max out, you know, if they can go on this path, you know, heavy, heavy, you know, the crown or heavy the, the head that wears the crown, something like that. But anyway, they're not they're not going, you know, you can't take them along with you because they you know, they're going to die out. We're going to live 200 years. You know, we're going to, you know, once you have this money, you're going to have all the monotomics you want. You know, you're going to have, uh, you know, if the girls want makeup, the makeup is going to be all monotomic. When you have monotomics on your body, like, like as far as makeup, you get super energized. You know, you're going to have gold glitter. And then what happens when you take a shower? It just goes right on your property. And then it just uh, cultivates the soil. So, I mean, you know, this is where I'm going. You know, I've already seen all the visions I know. And, you know, I create my own reality. So that's that now. So the tribes, so it has to be that way. And then you have that. So now, you know, I'm just going to mix this in. I, I I don't, you know, and then, uh, you know, so third here and then the fourth, uh, you know, you're going to have your businesses here. Let's see. Here. You know, your foundations and stuff. Let me, let me know. Let me think this through. If I'm doing this, I'm going to do this correct. Okay, you have to do one. You have to do one for just your family. You could do it in a tribe, or you can do it just for your who, your heirs. You know, uh, and uh, if you know if your wife is is going to be staying with you, and your wives are going to be you know staying with you, and they have they're having multiple kids for you, you have to have one. You can have, let's say, family trust. And that's it. The only, the only people that are going to be the beneficiaries here, are your your heirs. Beneficiaries. Your what you know, your 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 wives. Hey, let me see if that's correct. It is. No, it is correct. All right. So the beneficiaries are your, your heirs and wives. Okay. So you definitely have to have if it's fourth or fifth, you know, who knows, but now. And then so, uh, you know, and then the fifth would be would be your neighbors. Basically, that's what tribe is, is your neighbors. You're going to you're going to make alliances. You need to protect your your borders. You know, if you live and you have your heirs, your kids, it's going to take them 20 years to grow up. You know, those are going to be your, you know, your true soldiers. But but, you know, as far as, you know, securing your your, you know, your borders and, and uh, uh, having, um, you know, you know, having defenses, you know, for the zombie apocalypse. I mean, that's coming <laughs> like soon, you know, with, with Uranus goes into Gemini. Uh, I'm sorry, Uranus goes into Taurus. I'll, I'll do a video on that. But every time Uranus goes into Taurus, it's war. World War, uh, the Revolutionary War, Uranus went into Taurus. Um, the Civil War, Uranus went into Taurus. World War One or Two, I'm not going to do it right now because I'm going to stick to this guy. I got to get going. It's already almost nine o'clock. Fifth is your trust. And then the sixth is this, is, is your tribe. And then right in here, you know, you're going to have uh, your trust. If, if you're going to have your businesses, if they're going to be a collective business, you know, with your tribes, then it's going to be above this or side by side with this. Otherwise, you know, maybe this could be sixth and then fifth would be all your foundations. If they're going to, if you're going to keep them private, you know, like uh, privately owned, but no, all my, uh, you know, foundations, uh, you know, or companies, they're going to be employee ben owned, employee beneficiaries, all the employees like, like, you know, because that's the only way it works, because then they, they, they pretty much can't even like, you know, they, they're going to work harder, you know, so you don't want you want to have a zero balance. When you when you uh, here right here, you're going to give everything to your to your heirs. You know, you're going to give everything to your heirs or you're going to give them to the to here, you know, to the United Nations. 
you're going to give them to, to the United, you know, Unified Nations that you've helped to build and, you know, cultivate, you know, this is what I'm doing. And then, you know, the, this, you have, these are your brothers right here. The, like you've, you know, you've, you've partied, you've had ceremonies with all these, all these tribes. I have 12 tribes near me. I'm the 13th tribe. That's, uh, you know, th that's what it is. There's 12 tribes. I don't know how, but there's 12 tribes in my geographical area. There's 12 tribes. I can't find any more. And then, and then me to make a, a new tribe because I've been here 20 years. I have so much DNA here. I'm going to exactly what I say in my uh, bio. Let me find my bio. I have it right here. Uh, that's not it. Oh, come on. Give me a second. I'm not even gonna pause this now. You wait. You you you've been with me up till now. You're gonna wait a second. All right. Come on. I don't even know why this happened. Okay. Why did this happen? It rearranged my my stuff. Uh... Yeah, right here. This is when you enter the private group. Oh, okay. Well, I'll read it right over here. I'm not, I'm not gonna paste it into here. Um, am I still sharing? Yes. And my mic is on. Okay. So, I mean, this is when you add, oops, uh, oops. This is private information. This is just my, when you enter, when you join our, our private group, you can mail me, you can email me right here. If you're interested on the secure party credit, I have to know you're real. This is a private free group. Then I also have a, a private paid group. I have like pretty much almost like hundred videos that I can't make public, but because I wanna, I wanna share information, but I, I just can't. Like I, I, I can't. I don't want it. I don't want to. So I don't mean it. it's my name. This is gonna be one of my top level names. So let me put it right down. This is me right here. It's gonna be right on the seventh heaven. For me, sixth. Oops. You have it shuffled in, you know, you have it shuffled in there somewhere. But this is going to be my top level. Ambassador Yaton Payazid Ziber Mustaf of the Honorable House of, of Lita. Uh, and then, you know, when people refer to me, you know, you, you know, they can call me ambassador. You know, I, uh, I'm going to make videos. We're going to all, um, I, uh, I spoke to the owner of a Cadillac Hummer GMC, best vehicles, you know, uh, and I told them the whole story, you know, I mean, I, it's on my phone, but basically I, I'm having an appointment with him on Tuesday. I'm going to post that video. Um, so we're going to, you know, anybody want Cadillacs, I want to, you know, I want to order, you know, I need a bunch, so I, I need you know, but I'll, I'll order like 20. I'm going to put a dollar down, one dollar, not a penny more. These guys know we mean business. I told them I have a very large, uh, you know, family and uh, and tribe. And he's like, OK, Ms. OK, Ambassador Lita, you know, and that's what it is. I need to respect. So, uh, you know, I'm I'm ambassador to many, many things to, you know, to the to this, which is not this really. It's a different name, but I'm going to keep it private for now. Uh, I'm an ambassador to I'm a global ambassador you know, a global <laughs> planetary. Oh God. Because we get stuck with those words. So I'm planetary, you know, on a plane. I want to go and make, a, you know, go make peace treaties at Mount Maru over there with some, you know, some exotic uh, flying beings over there or whatever's down there. But, you know, Mount Maru is not on the North Pole. It's in, it's in Antarctica. You know, I, you know, I, there's videos, there's videos on it. Uh, and the moon 
all those markings on the moon are a reflection of our of our uh, geographical footprint, and it doesn't match. There's there's areas that are missing, so that means that that uh, it's it's a mirror. And what else is uh, you know? So when we get the yachts, we're gonna go you know make a beeline down there. You know they're not gonna stop us. We're international. You know we're international. They cannot stop us. We're gonna the the the, the dolphins and the whales are gonna guide us because we're gonna sing to them. You have a tribe with all your kids all singing and dancing and stuff. They feel that frequency. They're twenty percent brain capacity. You know like the movie Lucy, when she uses you know she gets like. 10% and she's already doing weird stuff. That movie Lucy is really good. If you haven't seen it, when then she gets a hundred percent and then she turns into, you know, it's, it's, they tell you truth, truth, have truth. Cause you know, when you get to that level, you're already, you get you, your light quotient, the amount of light that you could store in your body makes you, a, your light body gets activated. You know, that's what they don't want because what it is, is when they keep us, in terror up to a certain point, but they never, if, if, if they see that it's, it's getting really, really, uh, uh, you know, like uh, there's a lot, a lot of friction, they slow down because they know if it really strikes off that most people that, that are like awake, that their, their light bodies are gonna activate. You're not gonna be able to stop a hundred or a thousand people when their light bodies kick in. They're gonna be superhuman supermen. Superhuman Superman. I'm telling you, I know. I've had my light body activated, and it's and it's amazing. You could jump over fences. You could punch right through, uh, you know, cement blocks. I've done it. Wood. You don't get a scratch. You know, uh, you could turn invisible. All that stuff. This is all real, all true, and this is the path to it. You know, with the monatomics and you know, living naturally, living whole, wholesome, natural, peaceful you know, existence. So this is me here. And then I want to read the rest of that bio. Was it a notepad? All right. Okay. I had a roofing and construction company for 40 years. I'm a salsa dancer for 35 years. I play 13 instruments, just like a little skills and interests in bio. Like did I require for anybody to, you know, join this private free group? Uh, I'm a nation builder, tribal land restoration and rev revitalization, humanitarian, philanthropist, jogger runner, holistic healer, Reiki master. I'm a pastor with the Genesis 2 Church of uh, Health and Healing in Colombia. You know, that's Jim Humble. I'm the temporary uh, chief. You know, I, 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 you know, I want somebody to be greater than me, but if they can't, you know, handle it, it might take three, four, five years, or, you know, I could be the honorary chief until, until, I, uh, you know, until I graduate or I go ghost. And then I'll give it to the, you know, it'll be a vote, you know, a vote uh, with the tribe. So uh, of the Mastic Native Nation. All right, done. Even this I shouldn't have shared. Um, okay, now, so that's it. Now let me go back to the questions. So, you know, you could pick, you know, and you can do got ideas now. And this is, of course, going to be gold and gold or blood, you know, that you sign in blood. Regular garbage goes out. Okay. So now blood, then you got gold. You know, gold is going to be in here. You know. Yep, oh, that's it. And then up here, or it could be blood, whatever you choose. You know, you, 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 you know, you. It's you. Oh, okay, look, I have it on the same document. Okay, good. So now when autographing the top, all right, we, we answered that, it took us a and a half hour or so, but we did it. Next. There are some docs such as the common copy where the upper lowercase names are in purple font. Do we leave them or change to black? Yep, we just answered that. You, it's your choice. You're the uh, master and commander. Also, do we autograph a red purple? Done, miscellaneous. I have two birth certificates, both having different bond numbers. Birth certificates both have different bond, ending in 83 and 84, respectively. Okay, yeah, I have the same thing. On one of them has been authenticated at the state and federal levels. Uh, am I only to use the authenticated one for all of the templates where applicable, or do I incorporate both? I listed all, all six of mine. I have six of mine. I'm not finding that document, but it's in uh, the Schedule A, 
and I believe on the legal notice and demand and the power of uh, the power of attorney. I'm going to make videos on that coming up, but uh, you know, I have it. I have it. Hold on. Let me pause this. I'll show you. Yeah, I can't find that, but I mean, I'll show you what I have here. I can't find it right now because I have to get organized. I'm just, I've been, I've been doing a bunch of stuff, but I'm just going to show you right here. This is the Schedule A on the private security agreement. This is where you're going to list it in one area. I, I, this is like a template. But over here, you know, you push the D down and then you put everything here, all your documents, you know, all your documents. I'm going to work on it. I'm going to have a template. You know, uh, I'm going to have one template. You know, this is basically the template for the for the for the private you know group. I'm going to make all templates for a, for a, for a private group. But you know, the other like they're more premium documents. You, you know, you just do this on your on your own. If anybody is uh, you know interested in a private group, I got 100 you know videos, all audio recordings. You know how many people I talk to. All of them agreed to uh, you know I record everything. So um, otherwise, you know, everybody makes their own decision. What I do with that page. So you just add it right here. You know, you list them. You do one, two, three, four, five, six. I just can't find it right now. I don't know where I, uh, it's uh, maybe the one is, not, I, I never made one that's like this. I'm not showing my information right here on the video. So that's that. Next. Okay. Templates are applicable or do I incorporate them? You list them all, all even on a UCC, everything. The same verbiage you just copy and from the private security agreement, the same verbiage that's on there with all your documents listed, boom, boom, boom. If you're gonna register them or you know that 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 name with your name, JL, uh, you know, power private security agreement, you know, 1129, you know, with the uh, mine are gonna have a registered mail number. Boom, 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 boom. I have 20, you know, I have like, like 13 of them. I fill up two put two pages, everything. I fill up two legal size pages almost. And it's like half, like one and a half, almost two um pages with everything. And what was that now? Okay, is the file number on the birth certificate equivalent to the BC number? That's the BC number on my birth certificate. It says exactly birth certificate number. The file number is different. You know, there's a bunch of numbers on there. They have your file number. You have something written over here in hand. Like uh, it's uh, the, the birth certificate number. I got to I got to show you, but I, I can't find that now. It basically you have to do birth certificate number and then serial number is the number, you know, like the stock number on the bottom. And then you go, you, this is how you identify. You identify this birth certificate number. You know, this birth certificate number is here. And then uh, identifying serial number, X, Y, Z, one, two, three, seven, nine, two, eight, four, nine, 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 nine. then the next one, birth certificate number never changes. Then the identifying serial number on bottom, along bottom is, that's exactly what I did. And I have it all on a document. Is the bond number at the bottom of your birth certificate equivalent? Did I just answer that? Is the bond number at the bottom of the birth certificate equivalent to the bond exemption number that has uh, on the templates? No, the bond exemption number, is social security card. I, I uh, you know, so I, I know I answered that in one of the other emails to this person. So if I'm incorrect in something, you know, he, he points me out, like he found some errors in the, in the document, which I'm, you know, very grateful for. This is all collective uh, criticism, you know, uh, what is it called? Um, constructive collective criticism. I, I am open and I welcome it. Uh, so if I'm not, if, if there's something I'm missing about this question, uh, you know, email me uh, again, because from what I'm getting here, the word bond number, what they mentioned in like the private security agreement at the beginning, the uh, bond exemption number is the social security bond number, is the bond number at the bottom of the birth certificate equivalent to the bond exemption number. No, 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 no. Bond exemption number is the, is the, is your, is the one here, I'll show you.
I thought I, I thought we went over this. Yeah, bond number, bond exemption number. I want to make sure I'm right. Because why does it say bond number? I would have to look at my document. I'm not doing that right now. I have to I have to check and get back to you. Because I this is the bond bond exemption number. I have to search and find out where it is because I have to refresh myself because I haven't worked on paperwork for a while. I'm, I'm, I'm really behind. I'm really behind. But I, I don't care. I waited all this time. I'm going to do this in my own stubborn, correct way. I'm going to do it right. Come on. This little bug is around. It's, just, it's bothering me. And it, it doesn't look like it's a fruit fly. So I don't want it to bite me. Maybe it was a mosquito. All right. Next. I'm sure I'll have more questions. Yeah, keep them coming as I'm completing the templates. But the most prevalent issue I have is regarding the paper size. But we went over that only because I'll have to go back and reformat my templates if they are required to be on. No, nothing's required. Everything is you're in control. So that's it. We went over all those sizes and I went over the video here, how she has them. You see, this is definitely not letter. Letter is up to about here. Right. So this is all legal. You see how she did it on the back page of it. She bound it and that's it. Let me close this. Let me minimize everything here. Minimize, and I'm gonna add, close this video out. So I went over everything on that. This, this little bug is bothering me. Usually I'm very friendly. Oh, I'm not. I'm going. I'm just. Let's see. Yeah. Zooms. That's it. All right. So I hope this was helpful, and uh, I'll post this. But I'm gonna. I post it as a premiere. The reason why I do that as a premiere is because it, it takes about an hour for an HD version to be to get generated. And uh, if I just publish it right away, it um, you wind up watching. If somebody watches it right away, it, it want, you wind up not being happy with it. So, you know, when you're watching a video, let me see. Oops, that's not it. In, let me just go over a couple of videos. I mean, this video is, you know, this is really good. Uh, I, I put it in HD because this one is a standard just in case. Because I have a copy. I'm not going to leave this. You know, whatever. Anyway, so uh, nah, nothing interesting. What I wanted to say was when you watch a video, let me see, which, like, you know, so you watch a video, this is what I'm probably going to name this Q&A and I'm going to, it's going to be 53 part two. You see that this one says part one, because I, I'm going to, I want to do this regularly. Look, I'll show you. I have one set. What are you kidding me? There's no, I can't even, oh, I could do this. What the, here, join a meeting and I have to cancel. There's no tabs here where I can just go right to meetings. I have to do this and then go schedule a meeting. I have to have bookmark this tab. All right, I'm getting cranky here. This fly is bothering me. Here, I have my meetings, M meetings. upcoming meetings. I basically have one, I, you know, plan on doing one every time. So I just put them in as daily, but whenever I have, then I have it all ready. And I just, I'm already on this meeting, but why did I bring that up? Cause this is what this is going to be named. This video that you're watching right now is going to be named Q and A announcements, updates, and current events. You know, I'm going to make one only for astrology. If anybody's interested in astrology, I'm going to make one for health. You know, we're going to have a health day, you know, and I'm going to name them all that way. So and in a playlist. So this way, if, you know, just in case you, you know, somebody just has some health stuff, you know, I can assist. I've gained, I regained my health. The one for astrology is very, very important. You know, how to, how to, um, how to follow the moon cycles, you know, to know when the moon is at noon right above you. You know, you can't sleep. When the moon is right above you, you can't sleep. Uh, and then when Jupiter is noon, now it's about uh, eight, seven, eight o'clock. Jupiter is right above you. When Venus is at noon, you know, all this stuff is important because you get the energies when that planet is at noon, you know, and then, and then if it has a trine or a square, you get that energy either in the morning or in the evening. So these are all important. It's like, you wake up, you're like, wow, I feel great this morning. All the birds, the squirrels, everything. It's because there's there's an energy that uh, two planets have a trine and the trine crosses right above your head. You know, um, if we're on a flat earth plane, you know, if we're on a planet and, um, and I can go over all that. I'm going to superimpose this map onto a flat earth map. 
I'm not going to get into that right now, but I'm going to superimpose the, the, the natal chart right here. This chart right here, I'm going to superimpose it over like this. You do this. Open image in a new tab. You take this chart and then you go uh, and then you get the map of the. Yeah, so I'm going to take this image and put it over this. So now if it was this over this and we were here, that trine, look at this, look at this chart. Look at this chart. This was a year and a half ago when uh, Jupiter and Saturn were going into Capricorn or, or they just they just went into Aquarius. You know, this happened, I believe, in the 25th of uh, 20 of 2020. So so look at this energy. So when this energy was here all the rest of the day, you know, you're like you're like dead, you know. But when you pass this port here, if, 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 if this passes right over, let's say, uh, Florida, everybody in that whole area is all lit you know they're like Wah! you know but then as soon as it goes away it takes a few hours if you can imagine imagine this red line goes right here and then there's a red line right here what's that that's um australia right there when it's passing australia because this is south america america right here uh, and look 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 how this is like this and if you go on Google Maps, it's nothing like this, but this is more, this is how it is more truly, I believe, you know, the way it is here. And then, um, so if that line was over that, that means all the people in Australia are getting that energy and we don't get it as much in the winter. If this happened in the winter, which actually it did, we are getting it up north, but you want to be down in Brazil because the sun is closer over there and all this energy is super magnified. That's why those people are all lit down there you know they, they're taller they're stronger they're they're libido you know the women are sexy you know um and uh so you know that's it in you know in the in the winter up here it's freezing you you know your nails start getting all like diabetes looking you know it's like i don't like it you know it takes you six months to get my nails are perfect right my toenails i'm looking at them they're so perfect right now because i've i've, I've suntanned all summer you know limited from the, uh, you know, from the chemtrails, they, they, they sprayed us so bad, but I got a good 15, 20 full days in of like three or four hour tanning with mirrors. You know, I get like seven multiples of, of the sun. I don't get one. And, and they, you know, cancer, it can't survive in my body, especially when, when you're taking that much sunlight. Does it cause cancer? No, it aggravates the cancer you already have. It does not cause cancer. Sunlight does not cause cancer. It aggravates the cancer and then the cancer gets, it gets scared and then it attacks your body. Believe it. Next. And then it metastasizes. It starts going to other parts of your body, like your brain, your heart, your liver, and then you're done. Once you, if you, it's better off, don't even attack it and just, you know, live your peaceful, happy life and then just go and die. But if you attack it, it's, that's a 10 year process. All right. What am I doing? That's that. I was going to end this. What was I saying? Um, I can't remember. I went to the zoo, oh, because I was going to do this daily, and that's okay, and I was at the YouTube, um, so yeah, it's going to, so it's going to be 55 Q&A part two, um, but it's not, it, I did this one live, because I thought people, but people are not mourning people, plus we get a lot, of, I have people in Oklahoma, you know, uh, California, uh, Dakotas, so they, they're asleep right now, they're dead asleep. Um, all right, that's it. So I thought I'd share that and, uh, you know, I hope this was helpful and you liked it. So, you know, if you're just coming across, coming across this video and enjoyed it, you know, subscribe to the channel, hit the notifications bell, like it, share it, do, do what you do. And, uh, you know, it's wholeness. I'm out. Let's stop share and I hope everybody has a good day until we meet again.